Chef Scott Mortensen joining us in our kitchen this morning from Roaring Fork. And boy, have we had some great dishes made up here this morning. Thank you, Thank you for sharing, by the way. You know, Absolutely. sometimes restaurants don't necessarily like to share their secrets, but we made, you made some honey jalapeno coleslaw yes, earlier, which was insane. By the way, we have the recipes on our website, sonoranliving.com. And then you showed us your famous rub that you put on the ri on ribs. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. Now you're making brisket sliders. This part of what's on the menu at Royal yep, Fork? All three of these items are on our, uh, okay. our barbecue promotion through the summer here. Uh, this one here is what I would like to refer to as kind of our signature item. We take a, uh, an Angus brisket and we rub it down with that same rib rub. Uh, we trim out a lot of the fat and some of the extra stuff that's not really needed for our, our uses. Mm -hmm. And then what we do is we smoke it for about six hours. And you can see how there's a line of what we like to call a bark. Mm -hmm. It's basically like where the smoke has penetrated the meat and really kind of seared it and uh, kind of made sure that all that flavor stays inside. <laughs> and then it cooks Killing very it. slow for about 220 degrees for six hours. Just very slow, almost a kind of forget about it type product. Okay, I like that. I like dinner and forget exactly. about it. Exactly. Okay. Start it in the daytime and eat it in the, in the nighttime. Okay. So when it comes out, what we like to do is cool it down and then we chop it into basically bite sized squares. And that's really easy to do. You take your brisket and you go across it. To get it's what's so called tender, that's exactly. why. Exactly. This is our plank, and then we divide our plank in half, and then we just simply take them and make bite sized pieces. So now that we have our bite sized pieces, we'll move over to our sauce pot. Ooh, now what do you have in here with the meat? This is now, some, a barbecue sauce? This is our house barbecue, Dr. Pepper barbecue sauce. Oh, I love Dr. Pepper barbecue sauce. It's an old cowboy recipe My that, mom used really, to do that really, really does well with the smoke. Okay. Um, so all we really do here is we add the barbecue sauce to the brisket and we simmer it till it's about 160 degrees. Mm -hmm. Not enough to break it down, mm -hmm. just enough to really get it hot. Okay, and then so, you've got to toast your buns, which you've been doing. Exactly. Right here. What kind of buns are these? They look like very spicy or have a lot of something. Um, What's in there? What we do is we purchase from a local bakery and they provide us our own special bun. It is a Heartland grain bun. Mm -hmm. It has uh, mustard seeds, poppy seeds, flax seed, Ooh. all the good seeds They're for, good you. for you. Yeah, so while you're indulging in the in the badness, you can still <laughs> feel a little healthy about it. I'm all good. Right. I'm all good. I don't care how bad it is. Okay, load those babies up. So we've toasted them in a cast iron pan with a little butter. Where's Susan Casper? I can't believe she's not waiting on the then, sidelines here. And we're what we generally do is take a slotted spoon <laughs> and we just slide that on there. Make a little mess is not a problem. And then get the third one. So you find these on the menu. It's a barbecue special this that is, you have going on at Roaring Fork. All yes right, ma'am. This is our specialty menu. We got the onions right here. Oh my gosh. Oh, put more on there. More? Oh, yeah, that's okay. the texture part. Yeah, right. there you go. Okay. The whole thing kind of falls apart. That's the fun of it. All right, oh. there you go. Yeah, How's that? Yeah, that's great. All right, this and is guess when what? you need to have smell a vision. I know. Yes. This whole studio has been insane. smelling so good this morning. So then we take our little lids, mm. put our lids on there. Scott, and you we are, are brisket lunch. ready. You're amazing. Again, the recipes on the website, sonoranliving.com. Chef Scott Mortensen from Roaring Fork, thank you for sharing. My